What's up guys, it's Aiden, and today we're gonna go through how Diplo made Welcome to the Party. This beat was produced by Diplo, and for my Patreon supporters, I will be making the FLP available to you guys. All right, let's begin with the horn sound. The brass in Welcome to the Party reminded me of another song that gets resampled all the time. It's this song called Gojira Tai Mosura. It sounds like this. So I chopped out three brass one shots from this song. And they start off playing this loop. And this sounds completely different without any effects. The first effect that we're adding is this free multi-band compressor called OTT. Then once again, we're adding RC20 Retro Color and we're using some wobble and some distortion and we're taking up the tone. Then we're using another free plugin called Rough Rider 3, which is a compressor plugin. Then we're adding pitch wheel and we're taking it down by two semitones and we're taking the timbre up by one semitone. Then we're adding some parametric EQ2. Then we're adding some fruity flanges and some track spacer, which is a really useful plugin. This is a sidechain plugin, but it's frequency specific. So the lower frequencies of the kick are the ones that are being cut out of the sample. So when we play it with the kick, the lower frequencies of the kick are being removed from this brass sample, which is giving the kick more room. So when we mute the kick, it's gonna look like this. Following this, we're adding some Ozone 9 Imager and we're fixing up the stereo separation. Then we're using Parametric EQ2 to act as a low pass filter at the start of the song. Then finally, Ozone 9 Exciter, which is adding some distortion to the top end of the sample. Then we're moving into the actual beat. The brass switches to a new pattern here. We have the 808. And that repeats throughout the entire song. It's the Metro 808 Fade. And for effects, we're using Sausage Fattener and Fruity Wave Shaper to add some distortion. Then we have the identical kick, which as you can see, just comparing the waveforms, it matches perfectly. It sounds like this. Then for the snare, we're using two different snares and a clap. So they play together like this. Then we have this weird clap loop, which pans from right to left. And that just plays throughout the song. Then we have the hi-hat. And that plays with this open hat. And in the song. Then we have so many sound effects in this song. We have this crash, a reverse cymbal. We have some claps. We have a gun reloading and then a gun firing. So all together. Then we have a horn with a delay on it. We have the TM88 alarm and I've added a side chain to it using kickstart. So in context. Followed up with a horn. Then introducing the little pump verse, we have a descending snare. And 
and that's the identical snare, which is the 88 snare. Then this is my favorite fill in the entire song. Sick, okay, so we have the snare, followed up with this clap roll, this vox effect, which is the identical sample. So all together. Then in the final verse, we have one more horn being introduced. So everything all together. That's it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the background music, you can check their channel in the link in the description. And if you want to get your own music on this channel, hit me up on Instagram at Aiden Kenway and I will use your music. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and I will see you guys next time. Boy.